Warm welcome to all. We are going to learn a small portion in a design and analysis of algorithm. Today we are going to see about brute force algorithm. What is brute force algorithm? It is a straightforward approach for solving a problem by systematically enumerating all possible candidates for the given solution by satisfying problem statement. It is also called as exhaustive search. It is used to find a closed point, boundary point, minimum distance, maximum profit, minimum time and among given things by satisfying the conditions. It is a problem solving technique. We are going to see some of the types of brute force algorithm. Closed pair problem, convex hull problem, uh, traveling salesman problem, assignment problem and knapsack problem. Now we are seeing assignment problem. What is assignment problem? It is a minimization problem which assigns job for a person by satisfying the constraints. It is like selecting a person or a job which is finished in a minimum time. We can see a small example in assignment problem. Three, uh, three typists want to complete the typing work of a book where the typing speed page is given below for three jobs. Assign the best typist for the job so that minimizing the amount of work done. The question says that we need to find which job can be finished by which ty typist in minimum time. The given are jo three jobs. Job 1, Job 2, Job 3 and persons. Person 1, Person 2, Person 3. Person 1 can finish the job 1 in 9 seconds and job 2 in 2 seconds, job 3 in 7 seconds. Person 2 can finish the job 1 in 6 seconds, job 2 in 4 seconds, job 3 in 3 seconds. Person 3 can finish the job 1 in 5 seconds, job 2 in 8 seconds and job 3 in 1 seconds. Solve this problem by assignment method. We are going to put a small table with the jobs and persons. Job 1, job 2, job 3 and the combinations of persons like person 1, person 2, person 3, person 1, person 3, person 2, person 2, person 1, person 3, person 2, person 3, person 1, person 3, person 1, person 2, person 3, person 2, person 1. We are going to compare the question and the combinations. Job 1. Job 1 and job uh, person 1. Job 1, person 1 is 9. The person 1 will finish the job 1 in 9 seconds. So we are putting 9. Job 2, person 2. The person will person 2 will finish the job 2 in 4 seconds. Like person 2 will finish the job 2 in 4 seconds. We are putting 4. And job 3, person 3. So the person 3 will finish the job 3 in 1 second. 1 second. So we are adding 9, 4, 1 is equal to 14. The same like person 1 will finish the job 1 in 9 seconds. And person 3 will finish the job 2. Person 3 will finish the job 2 in 8 seconds. So 8. The person 2 will finish the job 3. Person 2 will finish the job 3 in 3 seconds. So we are putting 3. 9 plus 8 plus 3 is equal to 20. We are going to do the same for other, other combinations like person 2. Uh, person 2 is going to finish a job 1 in um, person 2, job 1 in 6 seconds and person 1 in 2 seconds, person 3 in 1 seconds. Is, we are going to add the, the 3 numbers 6 plus 2 plus 1 is equal to 9. So we are going to do all these things, all the combinations with the same method and we are getting 14, 20, 9, 21, 10, 6. So the minimum thing in this combinations are uh, person 3, person 1, person 2, 6 plus 2 plus 1 is equal to 9. This is the minimum thing. So the person <coughs> 2 will finish the job 1 in 6 seconds, person 1 will finish the job 2 in 2 seconds, person 3 will finish the job 3 in uh, 1 second. Totally 9 seconds. Now we found that the person 2 can do job 1 in minimum time and person 1 can do the job in uh, job 2 in minimum time and the person 3 can do the job in job 3. Yeah. Solve this example uh, with the assignment problem and thank you so much for seeing my video.